When we start talking about fire in the sand hills, one of the things that's very important is uh, fire has been kept out of the sand hills, let's say for 50 years. In some areas, it's longer. So when we try to mimic the historical fire regimes that came through this area, we run into a lot of problems because the fire can get too hot. We have an unnatural accumulation of fire. So when you first start your burning program, like when I first started my burning program out here, I had to do what we call uh, dormant season burns because I had to make sure that I did not get the, the fire so hot that it killed the canopy. And so you go in uh, during the cold times of the year and the winter times and you do what is known as a fuel reduction burn. Historically, that wouldn't have happened. Historically, the fires would have come through in the summertime because they were all initiated by lightning. We can't start out with a summer growing season burn because we'll get, uh, we'll get too much heat intensity. So what you first do when you come into an area is do several years, several cycles of dormant season burns to reduce that fuel. Once you've done that, you want to go in and start doing growing season burns because that will be mimicking historically what happened.